guys welcome back to my channel how you guys doing it's your girl Nara Ozim. today it's a vlog we're going to Oman and I'm currently at the airport I just got here I've had a very eventful day packing I'm at the airport now about to check in and yeah come with me let's go to Oman and have fun Oman currency. They don't even use the same currency in Dubai. Like, I can't believe a whole country. UAE, Oman is in the UAE, but they don't still use like the rams. <laughs> Crazy. But their money is pretty sharp. Ah, oh, finally, I am done with checking in changing money and i'm about to go and sit down at my boarding gate and it just feels like my boarding gate is packed to the max i can't find where to sit down but we're boarding in a few minutes so let me just stand here somewhere around here and wait i hope the weather in oman is good so that at least my pimples and acne can dry up so yeah guys let me just keep waiting Okay, guys, we're supposed to board by 5 35 and it's currently 6 11, and we still haven't boarded. And I'm just wondering what is happening, and they're not telling us anything. I just hope that we we'll board soon because I'm hungry, I'm not eating anything today. Yeah, that's the update. <laughs> is beautiful it's just as beautiful as dubai airport but i don't think it's as big as dubai airport oops i need to use my tripod it's just that tripod just gives you like a lot of attention we're always looking but anyways the airport is beautiful i'm here now i need to just go and get my baggage take a taxi straight to the hotel and go have dinner i'm hungry okay see you guys when i get to the hotel it's night so i can't really show you guys right now so tomorrow we'll have a scoop of everything happening in oman okay guys bye just getting to my resort it's been a beautiful drive you've seen Oman this country is amazing and I'm so excited for the rest of the trip <laughs> and I can't wait to just lie down and sleep but before I do that I'm going to go and eat I'm going somewhere to go and eat and then I go to bed and sleep activities start tomorrow <laughs> so 
so yeah I'm going to need to lay your salt okay Does this TV have Netflix? Uh-uh. No? No. Because yeah. of Ramadan? <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if it's because of Ramadan. Gosh, guys, I'm so tired. I was supposed to go out tonight, but... Yes, yeah, fine for you. Don't have any energy. Yes. to move me again <laughs> like i can't even believe it this is my first night in this hotel and they are moving me to another room for the second time but this is an upgraded room so i'm just grateful to god so yeah it's time to pack all my shit anyways let me do that now so i can move and have a bath and sleep oh god where i want to sleep i mean i even go for breakfast in the morning but i will still go even if it's nine o'clock i'll go and eat i'll come back and sleep i want to sleep on this trip i want to rest i'm tired okay guys it's 3 a.m tired it's my face anyways we're going to my new room i'm happy because it's definitely bigger it's an upgrade <laughs> So yeah, let's go. Let's go. Guys, this is my new room. It's on the first floor, so I don't necessarily have like a view, but it's direct access to the pool. So I guess that's fine. So I don't have to come downstairs to go. to have breakfast now and then I'm gonna go back to sleep <laughs> for a couple of hours again and then start my day of activities so yeah good morning <sighs> see you guys soon I'm gonna show you where I'm having breakfast and I'm sure it's a beautiful place
you see the view behind me? It looks like a painting. It doesn't even look like it's real. It's so beautiful. Breakfast is going well so far. I'm almost stuffed. <laughs> but I'm going to eat well and go back and sleep for like a good two, three hours. And go back to eat. And then go out briefly. So yeah. Um, sleepy and tired but I'm glad that I came here so I can rest so yeah this um, holiday is definitely for resting I mean an activities and resting for, for both most of so yeah guys um, I'll catch up with you guys soon okay I hope I'm doing a good job of vlogging this trip. I'm, I, I, I really, I really want to show you guys every moment, but at the same time, I want to be every moment. So I just have to try, okay? And I'll keep trying. So, see you soon. Hey guys, this pretty lady is going out for lunch and dinner <laughs> at the same time. Guys, there's something about my makeup that I'm not feeling today. I'm not sure if it's my brows or my lips. However, I'm going like that. So, I'm going to take some pictures outside. Then I'm going to one place called Opera House. They've already closed, but I'm still going to try and go anyways. And there's a place called Opera Avenue around. So I'm going to go take some pictures and um, what's it called? Take some pictures and eat. Because that's what this life is about. Pictures, food, enjoyment, soft life. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, that's it.
came to this abaya store and then I want to buy this abaya. It's so pretty. I have, I have just one abaya and I've had it for years. My first abaya, I bought it in Dubai the first time I ever went to Dubai. I've had it for years. And then I want to buy another one. Beautiful. Let me show you. I'm obsessed. It's so pretty, but I don't know. I should not. I just came back to my room and then I saw this on my bed it says enjoy your stay and then they printed my pictures from my Instagram page like look at my pictures <laughs> god this is so sweet and then the balloons and fresh flowers and then there's a little note here it says my name says dear miss uzim allow me to welcome you at Augustan palace my name is janariska who will be assistant during your stay should you have any inquiries for activities restaurant hotel please don't hesitate to reach me through whatsapp or dial to me from your room i'll go through your stay like this is so sweet with the cute balloons and everything like i just feel so special <laughs> I just feel so special, like right now. Like, this is so sweet. <laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Oh god, guys, all these pimples on my face is making me have sports. I used to get these topicals sports remover cream, like ASAP. Like, I even used like, my acne cream yesterday to try to, to, try to dry up my acne because it's just uh, it's just like when I'm stressed when I use makeup for long hours when I take dairy it starts to break out when I'm like when that time of the month it starts to break out so for me it's like I just have to find a solution to treat the spots and the acne because I don't know if I'll ever not have pimples again especially this my adult life However, it's day um, three in Oman. I think I have time is just moving so fast. Like I was literally just here the other night I landed and then I'm already in day three. So today is day three and today is my third night. Tomorrow is my fourth night and I leave on day five. So I have four nights here. I'm about to have breakfast now. I had a good sleep today. I went to bed late, but I still like had a good sleep compared to yesterday. And I'm going back to sleep as well. And yeah, that's literally about it now. I just wanted to catch up with you guys from last night. It was a new day, and I'm excited for today's activities. So I'll see you guys soon. It's time to eat, eat, eat and eat. We always have to like hurry because we have activities to do, you have to be on time, you have schedules, so I'm ready to this now. Well, I've got some tan, because my lip gloss looks really bright for me, but that's okay. I'll sort out my skin when I get back to um, Dubai. So yeah, I'm ready to the now. 
I'm tired massage. I'm in so much pain. I need to chill, okay? I'll see you guys soon. Hey guys, oh my days. Just finished taking pictures. Pictures were fire. <laughs> like they were hot. Hot with a capital with a H. <laughs> I'm so happy. And yeah, makeup is sitting pretty. Love it, love it, love it. I'm currently going to the souk. Tomorrow I'm going to the museum. I'm excited. I'm going to have dinner when I come out from the souk. And then when I come out from the souk, I have koinonia service. Because I don't joke with my koinonia service. So souk, dinner, koinonia. Alright, I'll catch you guys later. See you at the souk. Guys, I just got to the Souk extra. I said Souk extra. Souk extra is in Dubai. I just got to Mutra Souk in Oman. It's like a market. As I'm stopping to get some shawarma, my driver is behind me. I told him that he should follow me to the Souk. I don't want to go and lose in Oman. <laughs> So yeah, I just want to get some drama. I haven't had drama in so long and I want it to be spicy. So yeah. After that, I'm going to go inside the market and just look for like souvenirs that I can take home to Dubai with me. Guys, I'm done at the soup, Mutra soup. Time to go home, Mr. Said. It's a good day. Got some magnets, some abayas. Time to go to the hotel. Oh my god, my makeup is barely done. Hi guys, good morning. Today is day three in the um, Oman. Sorry, day four. This is day four in Oman. My makeup is semi done because I'm going to do my makeup inside the car. I'm going to the mosque. Just in my mosque attire. And um, I'm having breakfast now. And then once I'm done with breakfast, I'm going to the mall. I'm going to finish up my makeup inside the car. And I'm late. The mosque is by 11 instead of people already. So I need to hurry up and quickly get going. Um, yeah, everyone is looking at me because it's like, does she have makeup on? It's going on in her face. Why is she wearing hijab? <laughs> but at least I'm having my day early today and I'm about to just quickly do stuff differently. Even my food, my, even my breakfast today is different because normally I usually have like a really large bowl. But I don't want to have a really large bowl today because I'm going to. <laughs> I'm going to the mosque. So yeah, that's that about that. I need to finish up my makeup. Let's see. Oh. Anyways, I have to go now. Bye. Yeah. I'm from Nigeria, but I live in Dubai. Yeah. Rushing to the mall. Sorry, rushing to the mosque. <sighs> Mm -hmm. I'm at the mosque. It's beautiful.
Say hi to my YouTube. Hi. <laughs> Guys, this is Pande, he's from Bali. And he's been taking all my amazing pictures. So shout out to Pande. Hi. <laughs> Stop this um, makeup on the poolside, and I did it so well. I'm off to Oman Mall. This is my last night. God, I'm so emotional. I love this city. It's my last night. I'm going to Oman Mall, the biggest mall in Oman, and I just want to do some sightseeing, window shopping. Maybe I'll buy something. I don't know yet, but yeah. Let's go to the mall. I like it though. I'm gonna show you in the next video. But then by the time I post this, <laughs> you wouldn't have known if I bought it or not. But I mean, if you follow me on Instagram, you probably see if I did or not. But I like it. So yeah, let me show you guys. Oh lord, guys. I did not buy it in Azara. Like, I can't believe it. I have changed. I'll just buy the ghost. I was just like, see, did I buy everything I want or I don't buy anything at all? And I wanted, <laughs> I wanted everything in the store. Literally, everything. And like, Zaha is not cheap. You know? These things are so expensive. I was just looking at the whole shop like I want this one and you know, like I can always buy all these things in Dubai but then it's like that initial oh let me just buy it now you know but I didn't buy anything so thank god I wanted to buy perfume shoes clothes everything but I didn't and I've changed. I'm proud of myself. Like, I even wanted to buy some cups. I think I will buy the cups. Those cups, I like those cups. So, I think I'm going to buy those cups. And then I buy those cups. <laughs> I rest. Because this is Zara. Zara is, <laughs> Zara is a very wicked brand. Hey, we have so many nice things at once. Somebody can even just enter there and just say, okay, they don't have, really have things. You go there and you see things. You see shoes. I think the only thing that I don't really buy from Zara because I don't think they make nice bags. I don't buy bags from Zara. But shoes, clothes, dresses, tops. I got me on a chokehold. <laughs> but yeah. In my eating, proud of myself, doing just well. Yeah. Look at what I found. Guys, I came to get.
here at KFC. Freaking hungry. Lord, guys, it's 3.22 a.m. It's my last night in Oman. And I literally just finished. And I literally just finished creating content. Because as much as I'm on holiday, I'm still working. I still have to be creating content. So that I never, ever, ever run out of content. So that's what's happening now. I'm really tired. But I'm not going to sleep. I'll sleep when I get to Dubai. And yeah. Oops. I'll sleep when I get to Dubai and and take off this makeup finally. I've had this makeup on for almost 24 hours. I woke up by 9 a.m. to do my makeup. It's currently 3 a.m. So let's see. 24 minus 6. That is um, mm, mm, mm. yeah. I've had this makeup for 19 hours. I need to wash my face now. I've had a very eventful trip. More was nice. It took a lot of my energy. Then now, creating content. I'm about to soak. If, after I had a bath, I'm going to swim. And when I swim, I'm going to soak. And when I soak, I'm going for breakfast. I'm going for breakfast. I'm going to the airport. Airports, I'm going home. And when I get home, I clean my apartment. And when I clean my apartment, I go to bed at night. I don't think I should sleep because I think I will sleep on my flight. I'll sleep on my way home. Just have mini, mini breaks of sleep. But I'm not going to have like a full long stretch of sleep till tomorrow night because there's no point. I have so many things to do on like this week. So I might as well just like be knocked out like during like night time now and then in the daytime when i get home hopefully i don't sleep i will try not to sleep till tomorrow night and then that's it back to work back to life back to everything to be honest like the work doesn't stop that's why a lot of us are burnt out and tired the truth is that we actually have to um find a way to balance everything like before this trip to Oman the last time I took a break was in January the last time I left my house was in January and the truth is that even when I go on holiday it never feels like I'm on holiday because I'm always working at, at the same time like, my eyes are so red I'm obviously very tired even when I'm on holiday I'm working like I never feel like like I'm actually resting anytime even when I, I feel like I'm chilling when I'm awake and I'm thinking of oh my god I need to be moving I need to do something I need to do that I need to do this I need to do that I need to do this I need to work you know like this hustle culture is deep and everybody wants to make it in life everybody wants to be successful everyone wants to you know thrive Nobody wants to be left behind. Nobody wants to be mediocre. But for me, what I'm going to be doing now is... I mean, it's what I've been doing in the past anyways. It's when I feel like resting, I rest. And when I'm working, I work. And I work hard. I work really hard. So, I try to use... What I'm going to be doing now is my energy. When I'm, when I'm ready to work, I'll use all my energy to execute. And when I want to relax, I relax. And I relax well. I sleep. I sleep for hours. I don't feel guilty. Like at the end of the day, I'm not competing with anybody. I'm not on anybody's race. It's my own race. And that's what I intend to do. Just keep doing me. You know, now that I'm taking my YouTube consistently, I just want to keep putting out content every week. Every week, every week. I have a goal, I have a target. And I have to put out I have to I have to meet my deadlines. You know, I have to make sure that I do everything I said I want to do for my brand, for my business. For my finances for everything and the truth is that nobody's going to do it for me nobody's going to nobody's going to hand anything to you it's your life you have to do it for you you know you have to keep fighting for your life you have to keep putting in the work for your life so that's what i wanted to say before i go wash my face for like 30 minutes oh i'm gonna wash my face for so long I'm going to take a break from makeup. Next time I'm going to use makeup probably be today is Monday slash Tuesday to Friday. My face my skin needs to breathe. I've used makeup on Saturday, on Sunday, and on Monday. I've 
use makeup three days back to back i've used makeup like back to back like and i, I always take so much time to really wash my face that's why i can't even use makeup back to back because i like the thing here i do after i take off this makeup is almost as long as applying the makeup like i take care of my skin very well I, I know it's not even how I even want it to be. So you can imagine if I wasn't taking care of my skin, this situation it would be. Hmm. Well, I'm grateful, Sha. I'm grateful because I still look flawless. There's no filter. You know, I'm grateful for how my skin looks regardless of anything. Regardless of the little spots I have. And, like, it's still flawless. I don't have bumps or pimples or rashes or anything. I'm very, very grateful. So, guys, this is me signing out. I, I'm still going to go and have breakfast also. <laughs> like I said, so I need to wrap this video quickly. Oman has been amazing. There's still some things I couldn't do that I wish I would do, but since it's just an hour flight, and yeah, I think I'm gonna come back soon. I loved it here, I loved every second. I'm gonna come back soon, very, very soon. It's just, just a chilled vibe, you know. I loved it. So, guys, I'll see you in the morning. I need to go and do my final packing and after I finish packing yeah I'm just gonna go and sleep no I said I was going to sleep I'm just going to go and have a bath now and prepare for my flight my flight is by 11 I have to be at the airport by 9 I've checked in already just pack have a bath soak no, swim then soak and then go and have breakfast like, I'm just gonna be dragging myself all through the daytime Please, I'm not rushing anywhere. Do anything I need to rush. I'm not rushing to do anything. I'm not rushing to do any work. I just need to get home, clean my apartment, and rest. Okay, guys, I've said a lot. I'll speak to you guys soon. Okay? Ciao. Good morning, guys. Skin looks hydrated, thank God. I get a lot of skin here. Okay, so this is my last breakfast. <laughs> I need to catch breakfast the last time I fly here to the airport and I'm rushing. It's my last day, last morning in Alistair. I'm so emotional, but it was an amazing experience. I'm grateful. Yeah. Let's go back to Dubai and do some work. I'm going to start praying from today <laughs> that I get to do your makeup.